Hey guys, Chris here with TechRecipes.com with the tutorial in Microsoft Excel. I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the cool AutoSum feature that they have built in. And what this is useful for is if you have a spreadsheet where you're adding up a bunch of numbers and you have to create your own formulas to have it add the numbers. Uh, this will consist of you creating a formula that has tons of variables in it. So for example, it would be like C6 plus C7 plus C8 and so on and so on for each cell that you want to add together. Well, we can do this much quicker with the AutoSum tool. So I made a simple little chart here which shows how much money I made Monday through Friday for a month for week one, two, three, and four. Now at the bottom of each day, I want to calculate the month total in cash, and then I want to calculate the average of what I earned for each day. So to do this, normally you would come in where you want to put your formula and get an answer, and you go equals C7 plus C8 plus C9 and so on but we don't have to do this so we're gonna click the cell where we want to add our numbers so our Monday column will be going first come over and click auto sum now auto sum will automatically grab cells relative to where you click and say do you want to find the sum of these cells so as you see right here it says sum do you want us to find the sum of cells C7 through C11 and it will always add them like this so we go ahead and click this check mark right here and it finds the sum right there like that see how simple that is now we can do this across these other days by simply copy and pasting the formula so right click go to copy hold shift click out here right click and paste and it will copy the formula to each column and apply it now we can also find the average with auto sum. So for the average, we're going to click where we want the average, and we want to find the average of the month for Monday. Go over to auto sum, but hit the drop down and go to average. Now this built-in function here, average, will find the average of the cells you want. Now by default, it's just saying C12 because, like we said, when you enter auto sum, it'll pick cells relative to where you put it. But we don't want C12. We want C7 through C10. So you would simply go C7, C10. And it will show you a preview of the cells it will be using to calculate this. And that looks about right. So we go ahead and click the check. And there you go. And it finds the monthly average for Mondays in the month, which is $56.11. And once again, we can apply that across, copy, then paste it to the other cells. And there you go. That's how you do it.